Hello, uh, Jim Howard here in Fort Worth, Texas. Today's date, it is March 6 of 2019. It's uh, <clears throat> almost 3.30 in the afternoon. Going to make this fast. Just an update of what's been going on. Uh, you can see the containers over here, three of them. I've got the room in much better shape. You know, I was complaining for a long time that it was just... And I got four containers like this, and I have, I'm still working to get, because I don't want to have to sort through every container to find what I need. So I'm trying to organize it a little bit in my head. <clears throat> so the room is in much better shape that way. I have moved this printer over here. Actually, it's a printer from the other room. And I took the printer I had here into the other room. I wanted to start doing some scanning of documents and maybe photographs. So, uh, what else have I been up to? Oh, by the way, be a little, maybe an advertisement. I got my flu shot, and my ex-wife uh, also got her flu shot. And I encourage everybody to get your flu shot. Um, okay. Um, there is a note here someplace. Okay. Uh, this morning, I had on Windows, and you can see it over here, Let's see if you can see it. Nope, that wants to cover it up. Okay, I'll just take care of that. You can see it over here that uh, this morning I had uh, evaluation build 18342. And now I have 18351. Um, this 18342, which I had, was kind of, I can bring this other, whatever I minimized here, that's it. The one that I had was kind of funny. When I went over to click on, you know, the start menu, the start menu, did this didn't come up. Well, nothing came up. Um, what I had to do was do a right click on the start, and then this would come up, you know. And what else? There was um, something else wasn't quite working right. So I went ahead and moved up from, um, let's see. I went from the slow up, well, I also heard today that... Uh, The new version was going to come out today, 18351. So I went to delivery options here. Or did I go to, I think I, okay, I went to Windows Insider program down here. I don't recommend you do, you know, the uh, Insider things that I've had a couple of times in the past. It was devastating. You don't want it. I don't recommend you do it, but I changed this from slow to fast, and uh, then it updated, and it brought me the very latest, 18351, and that fixed my uh, problem with the start menu and everything. Um, for the last few days, and even in the past, I've been thinking, uh, well, I decided uh, yesterday and today that I was going to order today an Apple iPod, the one that runs three or 220, 230 or something. 
think that's the price. And uh, I went ahead and then I decided I was going to order, instead of 32, I was going to order the 120 gigabyte. I've never had an Apple computer before in my life. I've never touched an Apple computer in my life. Um, but I watched a whole bunch of videos the, on YouTube. And uh, I decided I was not going to spend the hundred dollars for the pen, and I was and I was going to order a ten dollar pen, which is probably what I already have here for, you know, that I was going to order a ten, and then later if I, and then I just started thinking, no, you know, that's a lot of money, and did I really need it? And I watched all the videos of, and I thought, oh man, it's really, really neat. And I knew it was neat and everything. But then I just decided a while ago, I just, uh, just can't bring myself to spend that kind of money. And uh, so as of right now, I am not going to order it. That's what I do a lot of times is, you know, I was thinking of, I just mentioned the other day that, by the way, I have my uh, LG 4K monitor over here, and I have my LG widescreen monitor here. Okay, on the uh, 4K monitor, you know, I was talking the other day about just buying another and I'd have them side by side that way with them both in 4k mode I could drag stuff back and forth and I wouldn't you know resize or be too big for the other monitor and what I've been doing is basically having you know the 4k monitor just in 1080p mode but I've been messing with it for the last few days and um uh, what I did instead of putting this into, I actually think it's still in 4K. What, what I did is I put it in uh, 3840 by 2160, and uh, that when I drag stuff back and forth, it's reasonable and it's not out of you know, so. Is that what I have it in? Okay, let's figure that out. Okay, <laughs> never mind. Uh, now I can't. Rem I don't. My notes. I'm not sure what I did end up doing. So let's go to settings. Uh, monitors. Let's see. Display. Okay, my wide monitor here is in, of course, 2560 by 1080. Okay, now this monitor is in 2560 by, okay, yeah, so I didn't write it. It is 2560 by 1440. Okay. Oh, I have it correct up here. Okay. 2560 by 1440. Uh, so when I drag a browser or a window now the this monitor over here will support 3840 by 2160 and that's what's recommended. Now if I kick this into one of these others uh, that are up in that range then I'll get a bar on this side and a bar on that side. So this is working out for me. But as I mentioned in the past, I was thinking about I'll just buy another 4K monitor and put them. So, um, so that's going on. Let me close this. And I guess we don't need to look at this because I've given up on that. 
I think I gave this uh, mouse to my son. I'm using the wireless Logitech 602. And I think I may go ahead and order one of these again, the 502 wired. This sometimes seems kind of flaky. Although I don't need all I don't need all these programmable keys, but I'm not sure what I'm going to do. I'm just sure that I guess I am not going to get an iPad. Uh let's go back to see what's going on news wise. Uh Yeah, the only blockbuster left on the planet. I think it's in Alaska or something. I think I saw something on that months ago or something, I believe. Up in Oregon, might, might as well be in, in uh, might as well be in Alaska. Wait a minute. Okay. Well, anyway. By the way, Netflix has revolutionized the way. Uh, by the way, let's see, uh, Netflix. Come what may. One hour and fifty three minutes. I highly recommend it. It is. It is excellent. Um, I think I mentioned the Umbrella Academy. Well, I take it back. I, you may like it. Check it out. Uh, some of friends of mine and relatives like the Umbrella Academy. I got up to season, or I got up to episode two, and uh, I just, there's things that I don't want to go t into it, but... Just things that I did not like. By the way, I watched this a while back, a few months ago or something. Gone are the days. Excellent, excellent. Um, I've watched all of the, a series of unfortunate events. I liked it, but the longer it went on, too much repetitive of the same, you know. But I think they were following the book very, you know. Um, the Ballad of uh, Buster Scrubs, by the way, excellent. Get Shorty. I only made it up so far to episode, what, five? And I don't think I'm going to go back to it. <clears throat> Medal of Honor. I'm okay. I must have watched it someplace else because I watched a whole bunch. I watched several of the episodes, I believe. Unless this is a different. Uh, no, it looks like the same one. <clears throat> Voices going out for some reason. Uh, beautiful girls is a movie that I love. You may not love it, or you may not like it, even, but for some reason. I've watched all of, uh, it shows episode two. I watched all of them to the end. My ex-wife, uh, we share this apartment and with my grown son. And I set up a thing for her, but I think that she uses for some reason. And I think that uh, stuff shows up that I'm not interested in, and then stuff like this gets, you know. So, 
Um, oh, Jackie the nurse. I've watched. Okay, this. So she hasn't missed it. I'm up. I haven't watched it for a while, but I'm up to episode 11. And I really like it. It's kind of depressing, but I, I like it. Uh, you might check it out. Weeds, I watched all the episodes of that. It was great. But towards the end, actually, you know, I don't think I did watch. I think I, uh, well, here it is. Season 7, episode 5. I think there's, uh, I think I did stop. Let's see. The Pinkertons, I just couldn't get into it. And I used to work for Pinkertons. But not back in the old days. I also worked for, let's see, Pinkertons, Burns, International Detective Agency, Wells Fargo, and a bunch of others. Um... Uh, Oh, Hap and Arnold. Great. Oh, it says new episodes. I don't think so. Hmm. Season three. Did I see that? Wow, I think there may be... I have to check that out. Let's see what else here. If quickly. I can put down movie recommendations. So you can find something real quick here. Of course, Apollo 13 was excellent. Oh, my arthritis. I gotta bother me. I need to take one of my pills. Oh. Uh, of course, I love The West Wing. I've watched it many times. I know the, the lines and everything else. The IT crowd, I've watched it over again many times. Love it. This again is Netflix. Oh, uh, well, I guess that's it. Uh, thank you very much. I'll, I'm sure, be making a video here pretty quick and be updating you on what's going on again. This looks good, which is based on a true story, by the way. The boy who harnessed the wind. But, uh, I'll probably check it out here before long. Okay, thank you very much for watching.